Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you for walking that path, opening up to me, letting me know your stories, your journeys, your trials and tribulations, and knowing that, you know, they brought you blessings out of all those wars so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell at bottom so you know when i'm about to upload my next video if you feel like you're comfortable enough to go ahead and drop me a line or two please go ahead and do so i would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacts your life and heading you towards a positive direction if the video has been very informative to you or just gave you some good vibes you would love to share with family or friends please go ahead and do so and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites as well to every wherever you see fit and thank you once again for stopping by my channel and showing love and support and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and um the relaxing meditation i'm listening to today is called change your, your thoughts change your circumstances manifest miracles meditation law of attraction i know we all need that in our lives because there's sometimes we you know we get on that our mind will go you know into negative thoughts or get gets back into that old routine where we're trying so hard to get away from so i'm going ahead and put this on for anybody who's you know really going through things and trying to change their their thought process and my video today is about twin flame 101 hey okas in a different state of mind lord have mercy i mean this is such a blessing y'all don't know i've been like when i've been telling y'all i've been getting emails i've been getting you know I, i'm going to one-on-one -on -one, you know kind of like a conference with different people you know helping them out in their situation seeing things um in a different light or you know me being you know out you know on the outside looking in you are able to help people and that is such a blessing to me and it's just like when i can see y'all from you know when i'm just meeting you and you know we can converse you know a lot and things are reciprocated between us and it's just like i see y'all in a different state of mind you know a different state of mind and that is a true blessing when you can actually see things for what it is and knowing things you know even though they were sent to break you they didn't do that you know some some people i can see there's a lot of empaths that you know during the retrograde and the shifts that we all been going through there have been mass suicides there have been mass killings because all these things were written you know like when i think about you know um redemption song by bob marley and it's like why do we you know when they're killing our prophets why do we stand around and look but it had to fulfill the book it's like it's already written these things had to come about you know these things had to happen but it's like we're we're starting to see things in a whole new different way now when it's just like yeah we go through our hell and high water and it's like certain situations we really wish will end but we know it could be a hard drawn out process you know a lot of people have been going through energy shifts uh draining just really tired um up and down emotions you know but we had to all go through this because it's like our body uh, our body and our mind is all like like it, it's just been thrown up in the air and just said you know what when you come back down we're replacing you but we're, we're putting the pieces back together but they're gonna be all different if you can get what i'm saying it's just like when i can look at my life and it's just like I, you know, people that are close to me and they really, really, really know my situation because it's just like anybody, you know, I, I put out there what I need to put out there. Not everything needs to be out there. And plus, I've been seeing so many things on YouTube. Just, I learn from looking at other people just by how certain things I would not do. You know, I mean, everybody has their own journey. Everybody has to learn on their own terms on things, what not to do, not what out to put out there because I had learned. The hard way a few times just like when i first started you know i would tell some of y'all my plans and it's just like not everybody is out there for my greater good not everybody's out there just wanting to be happy for me because they feel like okay they can't change their life but anybody can change their circumstances of their life you know it's just all in a state of mind on how you think about things there's sometimes you know we can feel a certain way but it's all on how you think about it and i said i'm not gonna get into that subject because that's gonna be on another video for tomorrow so but it's just like we're going through a different state of mind
And it's just like our thought process is just, oh my God, it's just amazing. Because y'all don't know how many times I've sit up here and listen to y'all stories, y'all trials and tribulation. There sometimes it took me a minute to come back to y'all. Because, I mean, it was just overwhelming, but it was just like, I can feel the things that you went through. I can see, you know, it's just like with me, I don't know what type that is. I don't know if it's just a medium or whatever, but it's like when somebody tells you their story, you can see like their, their story play out as they're telling you. And sometimes that could be like, oh my God, I can't believe they went through this, but I was happy for them because they, 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 they prevailed. They went you know, they went through hell and high water and had to go back many times again because there's so many times we have to go through that same situation until we learn the lesson. Let me pause, y'all, because my, my blue, my blue, uh, what is it? My sound bar about to go dead. So let me pause for the calls for a second. Sorry about that, y'all. My um, sound bar was about to go dead. It's just like lately my energy has been draining a lot of things because I know my sound bar has been charging overnight. So I don't know why it's draining like that. But my energy shift has been so like hyped up lately today. And I'm just like, I don't know what happened, but something happened over the holidays. I don't know what it was, but some shifts just done started because lately the last couple of days especially after i've been talking to a lot of people and doing my live chats so y'all need to come on and step in into the live chats if you got time it's like you have to check out for your notification out you know i said i was going to do it daily but when you know you start having plans for one thing something else comes up so i don't want to you know just look out for your notifications i'm gonna try to do them every day but if i can't get it you know there's something that came up or you know i'm just tired because it's like i've been doing a lot of life work and it's just like people that know they're, they're close to me they talk to me on daily they're like Rosalyn, you need to go sit down somewhere. You helping this person, you making videos, you're on live, you're reaching out to this person and talking one on one. Because a lot of people are not comfortable with putting their business out and they know, you know, once it I, I it's been said to me, I might make a video talking about a subject, but I'll never put anybody's actual business out because it's just a lot of people, you know, you you don't want people's business out like that because if they did, they would have put it, you know, maybe dropped a comment. So it's just like I use their experiences to say, oh my God, this is a video, but you know, I never tell you, you know, who's going through what, but it's just the fact is we're all going through something. So it was just like a blessing because it's like, I see everything that plays out in my life and I see all the progression I have been making, the changes I've been making that, you know, excelling, evolving. And I'm seeing the same within y'all and it's like, we're all let me see what what is it all we're all concurrent together <laughs> you know we might be going but there's some that you know they're eventually coming but they're telling me Rosalind I had to go through the dark soul I you know I didn't know this is what that was called because it's just like you know I've heard the dark soul I don't even I think I did do a video about that a long time ago but y'all did so many daggone videos you know I said well let me go ahead and put this one out because that was way last year and I might have said something back <laughs> different way back last year but it's just like when I see all the progression y'all have been getting into, knowing that blessings are coming y'all's way, knowing that y'all are just on a different set of mind and y'all have evolved and excelled towards something that was so beautiful and so positive. You know, y'all need to keep going and doing what you're doing because I'm telling you, you know, like people are like, Rosalind, I don't know how to do this, but yet this, you're telling me, oh, I need to change this. I need to, I'm like, you just done told me everything that you need to do. I don't. You just didn't see it for yourself. But it's just, I love when I'm able to help out people and just be able to validate, you know what, you're doing the right thing. Or, you know, I'm like, hey, you might want to, you know, go towards further towards this because I never give anybody any judgments. As long as I tell you, if you're not doing any kind of pedophilia stuff or beating up on any, on any elderly, hey, we can talk about anything. I don't judge nobody. As long as we ain't talk about them two subjects, we good. You know, but other than that, you know, I've seen so many of y'all doing so much great progress and y'all keep doing what you're doing. And I know there's a lot of people I've also talked to are on their way. You know, they're just now starting their awakening and they're, you know, it's coming in, but it's so beautiful and knowing, but it's a scary thought at the same time, especially if you don't know exactly what you're experiencing. So I've been there. So just when I know I'm able to help somebody, I'm like, Ooh, I've been through this. I can help you. You know, my, you know, I always like, dang, I hate if I, you know, somebody comes up to me and asks me about a situation, I might not know, but it's just a blessing that I've been able to help each and every person I've been able to, you know, interact with. So, you know, keep on, even though you might not get the things that you're going through and life might not make sense. 
right now or might make much sense like you're like okay i know the reason why i'm doing this but you know i really am not getting the gist of you know exactly what the point is for me going through this trust and believe the universe is going to send you the answers exactly when you need it anytime you put it out to the universe i need to see what's unseen or you meditate concentrate and listen to the voices that are telling you i'm not talking about crazy voices but just listen to that that higher self voice because your higher self talks to you all the time it'll tell you hey don't do this you know i feel good because i've been detoxing for almost a week now and it's just like i used to use marijuana as a crutch for my escape or use it it's just to get in touch with my higher self to see the things that I didn't really need to, you know, I really needed to see in my life that I wasn't really getting. And now it's just like there was so many signs for me saying, hey, Rosalind, stop smoking cigarettes. Hey, Rosalind, you know, um, don't smoke weed. It was, you know, slowing down my blessings, but it was giving me a lot of headaches and ailments and stuff like that. I really need to you know, let go of, and it's like to each its own. I'm not saying that's a bad thing because everybody has their reason for smoking weed. There's, um, you know, people that are sick, they are depressed, got insomnia, uh, seizures. You know, I used to suffer from seizures really bad, like, like 20 years ago, almost close. To, well, it was less than 20 years ago. It was like 26 or 27 when I first experienced in my my epilepsy, and thank God it only lasts for a few months. As well as I found out my father had him as well around, he was like five or six. So I'm thinking mine was like around 25, 26. So it was just like going through all these experiences. I knew I had to go through them. There are certain things I experienced that wasn't so pretty, but there was something I needed to know. So knowing when you're going on something, you, you know you're having a different state of mind. Be blessed and know that you are progressing. You're going towards something that is bigger and greater than you ever imagined. So keep pushing. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video. So now as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Have a blessed, safe weekend. Be responsible in everything you do. Know that you are blessed, highly favored, and truly loved. And knowing there is always something, someone praying out there for your, praying out there for your better days. And send out much love and light and positivity as I finally can. And um, and let me see my post notification shout out. Let me see who am I going to give a shout out today. Y'all got all these names written down because I try to remember people's names. Uh, much love to you, Joshua Flores. I hope you're having a blessed, safe weekend. And I hope your journey is getting better and you're able to see the signs that they're truly coming towards your way. So much love to you. Thumbs, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. Drop me a line or two. I love a chance to get to know you and make sure you let me know if you hit that notification. You're on the notification squad so I can give you a shout out in my next video. And much love to you. Peace and be wild. Mwah.